Hello. Hello. Hey. Yes, sir. Yes. Yeah, I was uh, in the queue, I guess, to uh, ask a question. Yeah. Oh, you're on. Ask the question. Yeah, ask the question. I guess people expect to talk to a producer or some shit I, first. I guess. I think most nerdly's coming on or something. <laughs> right now. Well, yeah, when we when when we the don't fo- have that kind of staff. When the phone so just, rings, you're on, man. You're on. Talk to me. Okay. <laughs> hey, my name's Derek. I'm uh, I live in Kentucky. 55 years old. I it have sure a home does. gym. Uh, 5, 10, 160, so I've always struggled gaining weight. I've uh, been doing the starting strength routine for probably seven weeks. Starting to stall out on the deadlift. I'm How much weight have you gained in seven weeks? Uh, probably four pounds. Eric, come on, man. <laughs> come on, man. Get your head out of your ass. Don't ask us a it question. It feels like, like every this. answer is going to be gain weight what, on this this whole this? hour and a half. Is, uh, you're <laughs> fat five nine, weigh one forty. No. He, What'd you say you were? 160. 5'10", 160. 5'10", 160. So he was... He I will was, say when I was 30 years old, I, I drank protein shakes 24 hours a day, got my weight up to 190, and I was deadlifting 455 at that time. But I've gotten older now and got, got into more of a fitness-type routine and running. So I'm just now trying to get back into... Oh, so you're running, too? I'm not now, no. I'm trying to rededicate myself to lifting. Uh, but yeah, I know I need to eat more. Yeah, you, yeah, you got to get back up to one ninety. You, you got to get back up to one ninety as quick as you can. This is this is, uh, you know, your uh, all of your lifts are going to be stalled immediately at that body weight. I mean, this is I, I can't emphasize this enough. All right, we don't care about your abs. We care about the numbers on the bar. This is a strength program. This is not bodybuilding. This is not fitness. It's not bodybuilding. It's not male modeling. You know, it's not aesthetics. We don't care what your hair looks like. We don't care. (laughs) Okay? So, at 5'9 and 160, you're going to be stuck. I mean, this is duh stuff, I'm not, right? I'm not yet impressed the squats, but I am on deadlift. No, you will be next workout on the press and the squats. Yeah, you're you're about to. You just don't know it yet. How much is your deadlift? What are you pulling right now? Two forty-five, three fifty-five. Oh, come on, man! Come on, Derek! Come on, man! Well. Years ago, I had some disc. I heard my, I had some pretty bad disc issues. That's one reason I quit deadlifting. So I've been right. trying to be pretty careful with it, you know. And I, and the way you teach is really has really been helpful because I've kind of started from scratch. How long ago did uh, you hurt your back? Oh, it's been a couple of years. It's been a couple of years ago. Like I said, I've about battled lower back disc issues and sciatica my whole life. On it. Well, your whole life. So your back is what your back is. Right? Is it dead? Is it hurting at two forty five? Uh, a little, not enough to make me quit lifting. Enough to know. Well, can you can you deal with it? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Well, then, what do you think it's going to feel like at two fifty? I don't think it'll be probably about the same, and then two fifty five. Probably about the same, and then two sixty, and then two sixty five. Probably be about the same, and then you you see the process. It doesn't bother me as much as when I do a touch and go versus if I reset every rep. You have to reset every rep. Because when you do a touch and go, your low back comes out of extension. And that's why you're going to hurt your back. That's why you hurt it the first time. There's a reason we do the deadlift the way we do the deadlift. So you won't hurt your back. Okay. What's, how big is your waist right now? Man, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a really small bone guy. My waist is probably 30, 31. <laughs> <laughs> I wrist about six inches, so I have tiny bones. I, uh, work, I had to work harder to get to 160. <laughs> well, uh, you need to work harder and get to 190 because you don't have enough gut muscle and enough back muscle to stabilize your spine at a 30-inch waist. 
Yeah, look, that, no, that, that's a woman's waist size. No bullshit. Your back may just stop hurting if you gain another ten or fifteen. You gain pounds. another ten, fifteen pounds, your back may stop hurting without even changing your training at all. Yep. Okay. Yep. And so uh, far, I've just felt pretty good. I've been pretty happy. But yeah. so should I, obviously, I can't gain fifteen pounds in a week. What should I keep on? Doing my deadlift every workout or start staggering with chin-ups or something else every other workout. How many calories a day are you eating? Do you have any idea? I haven't checked, probably. What did you have for breakfast this morning? A uh, protein shake and a boiled egg and a grapefruit. A boiled egg, which is seven grams of protein. Lunch had a salad with a can of tuna fish. Derek, you're not trying, man. <laughs> you're not even trying. You're not even trying. You're not even trying. You're a bodybuilder. You're not you even won't, trying. You won't look much different uh, between 170 to, to 190. You know, guys get all worried about how much fat they're going to gain. But at your height, you're 5'10", 170 to 190. He's 5'10". You're not, you're not He's gonna got look, a 30-inch waist. Yeah, you're not going to look that much this different. Is a, this is a skinny person with probably with an eating disorder. And if I agree with no, you don't eat shit. You don't eat shit, Derek. You don't eat shit. What did you have for supper last night? Chicken. And last supper, last night I had a big bowl of jambalaya. How big a bowl? Like a 15-inch bowl? Yeah, I'd say it was, you know, it was pretty decent. <laughs> did you... Did, how many How many times did you refill the if bowl? If it wasn't a two-quart mixing bowl, it wasn't big enough. <laughs> No, you don't. No, you don't understand. You don't understand. You don't understand, and if you do understand, you don't like it. It's one, so here the situation is your back is going to bother you, and your lifts are going to be stuck until you get your body weight up. And you're not going to get your body weight up eating the way you're eating right now. All right? A can of tuna and a salad is not the way you gain weight. Well, I'll get the doctor on me because I do have slightly high cholesterol. I don't care about the doctor. He doesn't know anything about your cholesterol, and neither do you. Derek's the doctor hit. doesn't know shit. The doctor thinks that eating more is going to make your cholesterol go up. Oh, my God. I'm about to get irritated with Derek. Derek said, Derek said, dump the call. Derek's it's, it's hitting too all, frustrating. He's hitting all the points, man. Yeah, he's, <laughs> he's, 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 he's just going checking through. them off. He's checking them off. <laughs> I am a dumbass. <laughs> I do sell John Deere tractors so that gets you back in good graces. Well, that's yeah, at least <laughs> they run like a deer, man. You know what's funny? He sounds like somebody who sells John Deere tractors. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Derek, God oh. help you. Later. No wonder Rip is so pissed off. <laughs> that's what one of the comments says. <laughs>